Marshall Soski, shortstop pitcher, and I'm a senior. Michael Sullivan, catcher, third base, senior. Sean Mangus, uh, pitcher, outfield, 2009. I was the assistant coach for four years prior to becoming the head coach, and uh, uh, that's it. I've been here for 20 years, haven't coached anywhere else. So the school opened in 1974, spring of 1974, so that was the first baseball season. They went two years without having a field. In 1983, they played for their first state title. They lost to Cherry Creek. Um, since I've been the head coach, we've been in the state title game, 1998, 2000, and 2003 was the year we won it. So we've been in four state title games as a program, which I think is uh, fourth overall in the state. Our strengths this year is definitely offense. Uh, we hit the ball real well. Um, our defense is also strong. Uh, we got good outfield, there's a great infield, and our pitchers just get a lot of ground balls and let the guys put it in play. Well, we got a lot of team chemistry this year. Everyone's out working hard every day, day in, day out. We're really coming together as a team. Oh, I'm a, I'm a huge believer in intangibles. I'm a huge believer in, you know, uh, your best team isn't always your most talented team. Um, we really, we really emphasize the team concept, trust part of it, and, and uh, trying to get the kids to, to really buy into, you know, sacrificing a little bit of themselves for the betterment of the team. And, and when you're on a good team, you know, everybody ends up being better anyway. Uh, my personal strength is definitely defense. Um, I'm a pitcher, and that's what I focus most of my energy on. You know, uh, I think I play strong defense, and I can uh, drive in runs when we need it. Pitchers have to throw strikes. You know, there's no there's no way to defend a walk. Pitcher's out there and he's struggling and he's not throwing strikes. You know, then then when the ball's hit, you know the defense is a little surprised and uh, you know that tends to cause more errors. So we just really emphasize the strike throwing aspect of it. Um, getting ahead of hitters. You know, we emphasize the fastball and uh, and then once we've established the fastball for strikes, you know, then we can throw other pitches. I can tell when a pitcher's starting to get lose it a little bit when he's getting frustrated and he's not hitting his spots and he's getting frustrated with the other guys making plays and stuff. Yeah, well, you want to keep him relaxed. I mean, he gets he gets too nervous up there, he'll start throwing balls and he'll start worrying about hitting spots. Sean Mangus is a senior pitcher this year. Uh, he's our number one guy on the mound. He's got a uh, full academic scholarship to uh, Swarthmore College in Philadelphia. He's a smart, intelligent pitcher. He knows what his own strengths are and he knows what his weaknesses are and you know he uses that to his advantage. We rely on him to put the ball in the strike zone and let you know the seven guys stand behind him and make the plays for him. Marcus Lowski is our shortstop. He's been a three-year starter for us. He's our cleanup hitter, line drive, you know, gap hitter with good power. He hits you know, his fair share of home runs, um, plays excellent defense, he's got a strong arm, good range. He's, uh, you know, a leader on our team, and everybody, you know, takes their cues off him. So we really look, you know, for him to, you know, set the tone for us both on and off the field. Mike Sullivan's, uh, he's a catcher and an infielder for us. Um, we've got him catching right now. Uh, he's our three-hole hitter. He uh, set a school record last summer in Legion A. He hit 29 home runs, um, which was three more than our previous school record. You know, Coach Mass. Maps has given me a lot of good advice. Uh, he's helped me a lot, you know, moving on next year, go play in college. Some of the best advice he's told me is just, you know, slow the game down and play at my own pace and let me do my own thing. Um, well, Coach definitely emphasizes hard work um, as an important aspect, uh, and that hard work can make up for a lot of maybe talent. When you can hear that maybe hard work will beat a guy that's better than you talent-wise, I don't think there's anything more inspirational than that. Coach Maps is a, he really drives players to work work hard on the field and off the field and try to be the best you can be. And he'll help he'll help you get into any school, he'll help you with anything. I mean he's a great coach. It's actually Bart Maps Field and that's my father. So Joel Klatt actually, when he graduated, asked uh, the school administration to name the field after my dad. And so they surprised my dad and me uh, with that at our athletic banquet. So that's that's nice and it's a pleasure, you know, to, to be able to play on a field that's you know named after your father. We want to make our team goal, you know, to get to the state title game. We want to set the bar, you know, at its highest, you know, and then shoot for it. And, and it doesn't make any sense to us to, to shoot any lower for that. State title, all the way. Well, we want to see if we can make a run at state. State championship, definitely a tough level to get there, but, I mean, the hard work and everything, I think we can pull it off.